Today we are going to be talking about composting. Composting is important because it's a great way to recycle things like food waste and organic waste that you might find in your backyards or in your kitchen, such as eggshells, banana peels, potato peels, stuff like that. We are going to be doing it step by step and we're gonna show you how to create your own compost bin. First, um, what you can do is you can get a bin of any sort. Uh, today we're gonna be using the kitchen bin that we have here at the Household Hazardous Waste drop-off location. And I already have pre-shredded paper inside as the base. Next, we're gonna add some dirt that you can just get from your backyard. You don't wanna use potting soil, just grab some dirt. And fill it in to cover the shredded paper. Make sure that you've got a good layer in there. So it should be a good even layer like that. Next, you can take some, a mixture of dead and still live greenery that you can find in your backyard as well. You're gonna to wanna to add some sticks to it. From your household, you can add things such as eggshells. So you wanna make sure that you crush them up in there. You don't wanna add whole boiled egg because it can cause um, rotting and it'll attract smells. So bears, raccoons, stuff like that can smell it. Then you can add something like a banana, make sure that the label is peeled off of it. We all forget about bananas sometimes. And then another thing that you can add that people don't really know about is actually tea bags. The only thing that you want to make sure of is that the staple inside of it is removed, but the bag itself and the contents can be composted. So you wanna mix all that in there. We'll throw some carrots in there as well. And then once you have all your items in, you're just gonna take it and mix it. If you have a stick or a mixer, it's gonna be a lot easier. But if you like to get your hands dirty, go ahead and mix it up. Just like so. If you need to add more dirt, you absolutely can. From there, you keep it closed. You wanna keep it moist. And in about two months, it'll be ready for you to use in your gardens. If you'd like to have your own compost bin, be sure to come here to the Household Hazardous Waste drop-off location on 84 Ready Avenue. The compost bins are $55. The kitchen counter bins where you can hold your food waste is going to be $7. And then also, if you want, we do have thermometers available so that you can check to see how your compost is doing, if it needs more water, if it needs extra grass clippings and so on.